this is a two-person passing drill, and it's really a two-on-two -two game that we play to, to help develop players and their ability to read the server, track the ball, and also read the movements of the players uh, around them. The problem of whose ball is it, or should I pass or shouldn't I, is a uh, challenge for players in the 15 and under age group. I think mainly because they, they don't often train passing with, with someone next to them, and they don't do that enough. Uh, yet, when it comes to playing in a real six-on-six -six game, uh, they're going to be asked to do that all the time. So, rather than doing something like a butterfly drill where players are passing by themselves and uh, each player back there knows that the ball is coming to them, you know, you're really not getting a whole lot of benefit out of drills like that because it's just not like that in the real game. Players don't really know if it's theirs or not until after the ball is hit, okay? Until they start to get a read on where that ball is moving, and, and also getting a read on uh, how people are responding next to them, right? Whose ball is it? Well, it's a matter of their ability to uh, perceive where that ball is in relation to themselves and others, and then also pick up on uh, reading the movements of, of players around them. So, bottom line, when you're working on passing, do so with two players back there, and uh, make sure that you're incorporating this uh, cognitive attentional demand with having that additional player there.